Hey guys! Please ignore the uh, kind of uh, man voice I have right now because I'm kind of sort of sick. And also, it's like changed. This is different because, uh, well, I'm not filming in front of that. Yeah, no, 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 thank you. But anyways, I wanted to make more of a fun video, if you want to call this fun. You really don't have to like writing or be a writer to do any of these writing prompts. You could just make two sentences and call it a day. It's kind of nice about it because they're stupid. Really just kind of strange that my brain decided to say, hey, let's put that down on paper. Number one, the backwards world. Write about the world in its opposite state. Gender roles swift, climate change, to age backwards. I actually did this once and I was surprised to how different my brain could generate stuff. You're at a gothic rave party, except you're a guinea pig. What's gonna happen? Rewrite your religion. And if that's against your religion, don't do that. Great. Take two objects in your house. It's a yoga mat and a phone. Now these two objects are in love, but um, it's Shakespeare. So um, make them tragic. Just died. Oh no, call 911. Now imagine the apocalypse is happening right now, but we're not going to worry about the apocalypse. We're going to worry about the top five tweets that are going on during the apocalypse. What are they? Selfie. This doesn't have a camera on it. Okay. You have to write a detailed angry letter to an author that killed off one of your favorite characters. Veronica Roth. I already have her. I called dibs. You write to some other author. I have her. Describe what it would be like to introduce someone from the 14th century to an apple store. Create a new planet, except this planet has to have nothing to do with any universal laws. Physics is off the table. For example, flying cucumbers or asparagus. What other healthy vegetable you like to eat? You are now your teeth, okay? Except you're getting braces on now. Now what are your teeth's emotions going to be like? Uh, I can't eat popcorn no more. Very dude, we're eating popcorn. I don't care what he says. What would it be like to meet your favorite YouTuber? Uh, I don't know about you, but I would get a free pack of Skittles and be riding off on a unicorn. Now you must rewrite a scene from a movie, but it must now include donuts. Don't care what the scene's about, and now must include donuts. Or pizza. Or movie theater popcorn. Good choice. Imagine yourself at this beautiful beach, but you're on a romantic date on the beach and the sun is setting. You're drinking champagne, even though I'm not 21. Don't drink underage. Naughty. Then, out of nowhere, a half-dressed Santa Claus comes running by being chased by a llama. What do you do? And finally, my favorite. You know there are Facebook people and there are Tumblr people. They're very different. Now imagine the creators of both websites meeting together and saying, these people cannot continue on on these websites unless they go to the opposite website and read the comments and posts of the others. These people do that, and um, who gets arrested first? If you want to write about any of these, be my guest. You have the comment section right now. It's your floor. Make it mic drop worthy. But I'll warn you, my attention span on the internet is about two sentences, so limit it to that. Anyways, if you have any other great writing prompts that aren't boring, you can share those below. Anyways, I hope you have a lovely day. Bye.